That's right, everybody. Dead Rising. Uh, we don't have uh, opening or ending sequence just yet, because I just decided to play this today, and I needed something to go up on today's uh, YouTube video. So, Dead Rising. I'm going to do a new game, 72 hour mode. I'm already level 50, and I unlocked some of the weapons, so... This isn't going to be a, um... Ooh, how to go from level 0 to level 50, saving all the survivors. I'm going to do what I can. I haven't played this game in years. And I spent more time uh, configuring my controller than I actually did setting up for this. Because the controls for this game are notoriously bad. And the graphics aren't spectacular because this was a Xbox 360 launch title, I believe. It's a bit loud. There we go. There's Frank West, photojournalist. He's covered wars, you know. I don't know that guy's name. Say, buddy, you mentioned something about research for a story. That's right. Got a tip that something big's happening. In a nowhere little town like that? They sure didn't mention anything about it on TV. Yeah, well, I'm freelance, pal. I don't make my living waiting for the TV to tell me what to cover. <laughs> That's right. You gotta go get it. You don't wait for things to happen. Well, you don't make them happen either because, well... You're really gonna wait for a zombie apocalypse Here or you're gonna make is. it happen? No, but... Okay, we got the army guys. No, but Frank is right. Uh, you really need more of a go get them attitude than what people put forward these days. They're like, okay, I'm gonna go apply for a job. And then I hope that they call. Uh, that's not how, that's not how you get a job. You walk into place and say, hey, I wanna talk to the manager. You get the manager in there like, hey, okay, so you and me are gonna talk, I want a job here. And they'll be like, fill out an application. I'm like, yeah, yeah, no. Well, I'll do that once you and I agree that I'm the man for the job. Okay, how do I zoom in on this? Uh, there we go. Well, he's quite obviously trying to uh, signal for help. I would press start to go to the options and change the sensitivity because it's a little much here. Now, PP is how you gain uh, levels. Look at your zombie standing up on top of that roof. Looks like a zombie. 
A real itchy zombie. Yes, I did. Yeah. I have covered wars, you know. You'll find out that uh, Frank is a wartime sort of journalist before doing zombie stuff here. Oh, goddamn helicopter. I want to see the center of town. Take me there. Roger. You know, this game is, uh... There's some moments where it's like, wow, that's brutal as shit. Let me turn this down just a skosh. I think my voice might be a little loud. There we go. You gotta be kidding me. Yeah, there's moments where it's like, man, that's brutal as fuck. This is this is like a real serious zombie game. But then when you see him dress up like a fucking eight year old and beating zombies to death with a wiffle ball bat. It's Frank. Frank West. Remember that name. You're lucky if you don't not get shot down, buddy. Hello there. Huh? Hey. You're the reporter, aren't you? Yeah. No. You came alone yeah I'm freelance you know go on the battlefield alone no crew so uh what's going on around here anyway you came by helicopter didn't you what did you see from the sky well if it were just a riot I doubt the military would quarantine the entire area. The moratorium on information getting out is a little... extreme, in my opinion. There's, uh, something else I can't put my finger on. Doesn't sound like civil disobedience. It's too quiet. <laughs> Almost as if... everyone's already dead. Yeah. So why don't you just tell me already? What's going on? I think you'd better see for yourself. This, my friend, is hell. 
Now that guy's name, it turns out his name is Carlito. That Carlito's a good looking guy. And, well, Frank West isn't a fucking ugly man either. He's a little less conventionally handsome than Carlito, but I'm pretty sure if I was a chick, I wouldn't kick him out of bed. But a lot of the depictions of Frank West show him wearing a black suit. Uh, maybe that's how he dresses in later games, but in this, he's wearing a uh, white like dress shirt. And that's clearly a leather jacket. And he's wearing a pair of what, khaki pants or green. What is khaki? Is khaki... Yeah, khaki's green, I believe. But, uh... We gotta jump. I can't attack here, because... Carlito is a, um... Mission-critical NPC, so... There's no, uh... Attacking him outside of cutscenes and whatnot. Let's take a look at the. What in the world? Okay, here are all the things I've unlocked, including the real Mega Buster, which is the weapon you get for killing 54,900 whatever in a single playthrough. I'm not going to kill anywhere near that many zombies in this playthrough. I might kill maybe a thousand. So I'm really more of a get to the objective, kill only things that get in your way. Welcome to the Willamette Mall. I haven't been inside of an actual shopping mall in years. If you're watching this, Jenna, the last time I was in a mall is when we ate those uh, Harry Potter jelly beans hey, together. Right that was what? 2016 maybe Yeah, it is. It's the you perfect time. You yourself eaten alive by zombies? What? Did you just say zombies? Take a look out there. If those ain't zombies, what would you call them? That one just got a rash. There's been more and more of them since last night. Now, they're all that's out there. Heck, look on the bright side. Zombies are stupid and slow. We should be safe in here. All right, then. Feel like making yourself useful? Take a look around the mall. Bring anything we can use for the barricade back here. On delay. Come on, pronto. <laughs> Oh, that guy. I don't know his name, but uh, let's go to options here. And camera sensitivity. Let's turn that down a bit because I want to. Oh, no, no. Press up. Okay, camera. Verleen, Dana, Mark, Kathy, Alan, 
I get a bag of chips here. Uh oh. Oh, who's all this? This old man. Huh? You! Stop right there! Do you have any idea what you've done? Why did you summon me to this place? What are you planning? Would you calm down? I don't even know what you're talking about. Harum. What the? Oh my god, look at that. She's got the fucking strength of a goddamn PCP addict. That escalated quickly. Now get off me. Now, I'm only going to record up to a certain point this episode because if you guys follow me on Twitch, you'll know that I stream Mondays huh? through Friday, Jackbox, and I got to do a stream in about 30 minutes, so. Where are the others? I don't know. I hope they got away. No, that's Otis, the, uh... No. As long as those things are in the mall... The jack-of-all-trades mall employee. That's Brad. Uh... What are you doing? The air ducts. They'll get us back into the mall. And apparently, those things aren't smart enough to use the ducts. So they won't be a factor. <laughs> Wait a minute. You want to get back in there? What for? <sighs> hey. <sighs> nice camera. Are you a photographer? As a matter of fact, I am. Frank West, photojournalist. Could you show me some pictures, Frank? You really seem to know what you're doing. Who are you guys, anyway? And what are you... I took that one near the entrance. That guy do something? No. Thanks for showing me, though. Uh, hey, we're not done talking yet. Just who are you guys? I'm Jesse. The man you saw earlier is Brad. That's all I'm authorized to tell you. Okay, this is when the game actually starts. 
Okay, Otis. How you doing, buddy? Hey, you ain't planning on going back into the mall, are you? I wouldn't do that if I were you, but if you know, blah, 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 blah. Uh, yeah, take this radio and this map. And he's gonna call me up on the radio every chance he gets. Now, here's where Jesse, uh, she's gonna be my. Ooh, I'm gonna bring. Coffee creamer. Because you eat food to get your health back in this. Watch this. Glug, 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 glug. And you can save your game here. Now, it used to be there was only one save file for this, and it was very frustrating because it... Now you could actually change your save files, and... Like, say, hey, oh, that didn't work. Let me go back to the start of the day. But that'll have to wait till next time because I got a stream to run and I still need to eat breakfast before that. So, part two tomorrow will include zombie killing like you wouldn't believe, I promise. I'll kill an extra special amount of zombies just to make up for today's lack of action. So, I'll see you then. Take care and stay safe.